guys. Me and Nick here, oh. my brother. We just arrived in Boise, Idaho. We're going north to Cascade Lake. We're gonna target some monster, monster perch. That's right. Um, that. Bucket list spot. We're waiting for his buddy to come get us. Actually, his college roommate who lives here. We're gonna target some big perch for you guys this weekend. So stay tuned. It might get crazy. Nick picked us up at the airport. Nick and Nick in the front seat. We're out here to target some perch. Hang on to your seats, guys. It's gonna be a good one. Welcome to Idaho, Northwoods. Headed west, we're out here with Nick and Nick, my brother Nick, his college roommate Nick, who happens to live out here on a pretty special place. Yeah, well, welcome to Idaho, Luke. Thank you, so, sir. So uh, you traveled 1,500 miles from Minnesota to ice fish in Idaho. For perch, guys. We're targeting perch today. Really, really big perch. So we're gonna head out in the water. We're already a little behind. It should say ice. It is ice. It is ice. It's not water. No. It's hard water. If we find water, we got problems. That's true. <laughs> we got the sleds ready. Keep her on the ice. Keep her topside. We're going. We'll see you on the ice. <laughs> Uh, Nick, let's uh, tell people kind of what we're going to be doing today and how we're going to be rigging up some rods. Yeah, so what we're going to do, Luke, is we're going to set up a couple dead stick rods, and we're going to use these on what we call a, uh, a jigger trotter. So this is a little bit of a rod holder system built here in Idaho by a local guy, and you stick your rod in there like that, you get a little breeze, and it kind of bounces that dead stick rod up and down, gives it a little extra action as opposed to just sitting there in a, uh, in a static type of position. So um, today we're going to be trying to set up our dead stick rods on little jigs that are going to run a real horizontal position. So we want to make sure that our knot is just right so it keeps that, you know, in a, in a straight line across like that. We're going to take just a couple little wax worms, stick on here and drop her down the hole. Well guys, you heard it from Nick. We're out here on Cascade Lake. We're targeting some monster perch. We're going to be doing some jigging rods. We're going to be doing some dead sticks. Got my brother Nick here with us. Hey everybody. We're going to catch some fish. Let's do it. Let's get to work. Nick hooked up here right away. Might not be a monster, but it's a heck of a start. And we actually got our, uh, our first rainbow trout of the day on the line is what we have here. It sometimes get in the way of our perch fishing, but we'll go ahead and bring him up the hole and let him head back down after we get a quick, quick release here. Beautiful fish. Nice rainbow trout. Get this jig out of his mouth and drop him back down the hole. Get off the fin there. I like it when they do a nice little spin on you and wrap that line around. So here we go. Let her go back down the hole. Give somebody else a chance to catch it. There she goes. On to the next one. What I had here is he came and he hit it and I was setting up the other rod, took the rod down and I came and tried to set it and I missed him, put it right back down and he just slammed it again and here it is, it's another rainbow. It's a nice rainbow. Man, these things are aggressive today. Nice fish. Look at that, huh? And these trout guys, you want to get those fish right down right away. They're, they don't do well out of the water. 
Give her the, the old boot scooting boogie. Oh yeah. Say bye to her. See you later, buddy. Yeah, a little wave too, huh? Nice fish, Nick. Nice. Fist bump for the cam. Let's get the perch, huh? Nice fish. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> perch fishing. Sorry about the late, the late go on this, but check out the size of these perch. It's the biggest perch I've ever caught. And uh, it's big. <laughs> We're gonna, I don't know how big this fish is. Looks like it's probably in that pound and three quarter range, Luke. Yeah, pound and three quarter. That's a nice 14, 14 and a half inch perch. And these fish, this fish, I marked it on towards the bottom. I was jigging with this VMC Tingler spoon right here and it came up and it got heavy real quick. I'm so excited right now. Right here, right here guys. Just a beautiful, beautiful Idaho perch. The bellies are just super thick on these fish. That's a great start to the day. That's what it's all about it right is there. Beautiful, beautiful fish. Let's see if we can't get on some more. We're gonna let this one go right back into the depths. That's how perch fishing's done in Idaho. I'm excited, that was awesome. Well, Luke, looks like we're on another fish here. I don't think it's uh, real big, but we'll get her up and take a look. He's digging down oh in there. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that. Just toads. Look at that fish. <laughs> <laughs> the size. <laughs> you know, that's a nice average Cascade Jumbo, if you can believe that. You know, that's in that pound and a half, pound and three quarter range. You know, just a real nice fish, 14 inches. You know, nice big belly on it. Those bright orange fins on there. You know, that's a, that's a great fish. We're gonna go ahead and pop this hook out of here. We're gonna drop her right back down the hole where she came from. See if we can't get back on a few more. That's a great start to the day though. And there she goes, just like that. Fist bump. Here we go, that's nice what we fish. came for, right? Yes, sir. All right, <laughs> let's get some more, drop her back down. Well, watching my uh, dead stick here and all of a sudden she just went wham. And then here's what we got. Oh, look at that. That's, that's my first jumbo, baby. Man, it's just not even real. No way. Wow. It's so big. Wow. <laughs> what were you doing when you caught that fish? Well, was that was, uh, dead stick? This was on the dead stick, yeah. I was jigging with the other one, and this one started tapping. Nick noticed it and yelled at me and ran over, and here's what was there, so. Definitely could feel a difference from the rainbow trout. She was a lot heavier, deeper, like you said, they kind of want to just settle down to the bottom and stay there. And yeah, those perch will really want to dig down and you get a lot of head shake out of the rainbow and the perch will feel a lot of digging out of them. Yeah. So is this about your pound and a half or so? Yeah, that that's a nice perch? kind of average cascade jumbo average right cascade there. cascade fish, that's beautiful. Okay, awesome. Hey, where's my fist bump this time? You get it. Thanks. Okay. We're good. Get a release on this bad boy. Yeah, there we go. Get down there. Gonna wave at you like the sturgeon did. Yep, there he goes. Nice work. Awesome. letting us stay in his condo and taking us out on his snowmobile, showing us the ropes on how to catch these giant, giant Idaho perch.